One of my favorite programs to work on the go with is Affinity Designer on my iPad. The program is a powerhouse of an app that works wonders for those of us who create service pattern designs. Affinity is a dream to work in and if you haven't heard, there was an update and Serif officially released version 2 of all three apps on the desktop and the iPad. This month in this class, we will be exploring the updated Affinity Designer version 2 on the iPad, its interface, and I will be sharing my tips and tricks that I find make the design process more streamlined. We will also explore ways to create different templates that will work for different pattern types to help elevate your skills on more complex patterns, such as the rectangle half drop, diamond, and stripe repeats. Hello everyone, welcome to my latest class. If this is your first class with me, welcome. I'm Jen Vigia Lazan, and I will be the one guiding you through this creative course. I'm a freelance graphic designer, illustrator, and educator based out of the Midwest, and I run Bella and Sophia Creative Studio. If you want to learn more about me, you can find me online at www.bellasophiacreative.com. You can also check out my YouTube channel, The Creative Studio, where you will get a behind-the-scenes view of the work that I do as a creative freelancer, and find a huge library of free tutorials catered to those of you who are interested in graphic design, programs like Affinity and Procreate, as well as art and illustration. If this is your first foray into my classes relating to surface pattern design or your first time building patterns on the iPad, I highly suggest you check out some of my previous surface pattern design classes. I have a variety of beginner and more complex classes within my course library that will walk you through the surface pattern design process and building repeats right on your iPad. If you're interested in using more traditional mediums in surface pattern design, definitely check out my most recent class, Surface Pattern Design, Digitized Traditional Artwork in Affinity Photo photo version 2 on your iPad. In today's class though, we will take the basic design process a little further and explore three complex repeats. A half drop repeat in rectangle format, a diamond repeat, and stripes. Expanding on the type of patterns that you can create really helps to add visual interest to your patterns as well as helps to elevate your portfolio. Choosing the right pattern repeat for your design will depend on what sort of look and feel that you're going after. But the wonderful thing is you can keep experimenting with your repeat layouts until you get the result that you're going after.